What's up, bro boys? In this video, you're gonna learn how to finesse your grails for cheap so you don't have to eat hopes and dreams for breakfast. How much you want for them? I don't know. 100 bucks? Um, no. I'll give you about tree fitty. But clout doesn't come easy nowadays as everything is always sold out, and when it's not retail, it's not fair. Like, like what, what, what is that number? Look at that. Like, that, that's so thick that your girlfriend doesn't watch you following it on Instagram. Thick with cues, guys, and I'm not trying to have you disrespect women like that, so I'm gonna rate this thing down into three things, and they're gonna be drop strategy, third party, and crowdsourcing. And before we get started, I wanna thank StockX, StockX, right? Yeah, you got it right. For sponsoring your boy and the video and keeping the snakes out the grass because you know, nobody wants to get scammed with fakes. And you know, saving you the most money off resale so that you can afford more supreme and more important. Starting with drop strategy, I'm talking we gotta attack the problem from the source. Since everyone's trying to cop the thing that you're going for as well, we gotta be better than the competition. My favorite strategy is just being rich and entitled. You so fucking precious when you smile. No, I'm not talking about fighting everyone and lying, guys, but I mean, if you do, please, please record it. A good way to increase your chance of copying, especially online, is to stay informed of drop times down to the actual second and make sure you enter every single raffle that you see. But for drop times, definitely follow some Twitter accounts with notifications on to keep up with the times, but even then, you still have to be quick because there are robots out there kicking our ass. I'm not saying you have to get a bot, but like, it, it definitely helps. That's all I'm saying, guys. That's all I'm saying. It's definitely beneficial, but it ruins the culture. And all of these just increase your chance on drop day, but nothing is guaranteed. So if you still do miss out, there are other options to go to. Up next, we got third party services. And obviously my top pick is StockX because they got graphs. They got biddies. They got Supreme face masks. Look at this. Do you see that? You see that? Entrepreneur, guys. And they even respect women. Oh my God. God? Okay, anyways, their site looks official, so I can at least feel professional about it, you know, and convince myself to think that the 900, $900, the $900 I'm about to spend on some shoes is a calculated investment, you know? Yep, graphs, yeah, yep, graphs, you know, yep, market looking, market looking good and volatile, whatever. It's a calculated investment, mom. But yeah, you can see what others are paying and what the shoes sold for in the past. You know you're getting the best deal. To test this, as you saw earlier, I was looking into some acronym Prestos as I have for a while and with StockX, you can see what's being sold even on other websites. This is so you know you're getting a deal even for resale. I also ended up buying a pair of Stone Island Sock Darts for under retail price so you can see that you can also get steals on there. And for verification, let me show you how it works real quick from some official footage straight from the StockX headquarters. Not really, I just did it real quick in my house. But uh, I mean, so, so you see like, you know when you buy a pair of shoes, like instead of it going straight to your place from the seller, you know, it's hella sus, like he could put anything in there. So instead, they ship it to StockX first, where a team of dudes legit checks your shoe to make sure you're not getting some Chinese takeout. And when they're done eating it, verifying its legitimacy, then they send it over to your place. And you get this free checkmark keychain to rock. Like, forget the shoes, dude, you get a free keychain? But the verification process and how you can see what others are paying and what the shoe is going for is what makes stocks, wait, is this stocks or stock X? Dude, it's stock X. You've been saying it right the whole time. Okay, making stock X my go to spot for finding stuff to flex with on Insta. Uh, uh <laughs> who am I kidding? I'm trying to flex, guys. Lastly, we got crowdsourcing, and by this, I mean friends and groups. Like, asking a homie to assist you is never a bad tactic. Sometimes you'll get a decent price because, you know, they're your boy. If not, then they fake. They fake. Can I they get a legit fake. check on my friend? Fake. And if you don't have any friends, then join a Facebook group as sometimes people are willing to let stuff go for cheaper to a more reliable community. Network around Facebook and find one as it's very popular nowadays because trust me, you're not the only one looking to impress your crush on IG with some heat. All right, so to wrap this up, just treat yourself, guys. But uh, um, don't blame me if your car gets repoed. Okay, so thanks for watching the video, guys. But even bigger thanks to StockX for sponsoring the video. Go check them out with my link down below. I honestly really like using their site when looking for stuff because I feel like a professional broke boy. But follow my Instagram at ChristianVY so I can flex on you. And tweet at me at ChristianVYYT for some quality behind the scenes. Email me at frugalaesthetic at gmail.com for anything. And yeah, guys, stay lit. Respect women. But most importantly, 